everyone, so today I wanted to show you guys or give you guys a tour of my medicine chest or my skincare cabinet. I thought this would be kind of a fun video for you guys to see and I hope that you guys enjoy it. And also, if you have ever wondered what I look like right before I go to bed, wonder no further because this is exactly what I'm going to look like when I head to bed right after this video. No makeup on and I'm wearing my Nick and Nora pajamas which I love and they have makeup all over them with monkeys standing on scales in bathrobes and putting on makeup with bobby pins and lipsticks all over the place. Okay, let's get started with this tour. Okay, so here is a quick overview. Okay, so starting from the left on the bottom, I have my new facial wash which I actually just got today. Today marks the first day that I got a new facialist lady. She's just a lot closer to my house than my old one was. Seems to know what she's talking about, so she recommended this facial wash to me. And it happens to be for perfect timing because I just ran out of my arm on one, which I absolutely love. But I wanted to branch out a little bit and try something new. I trusted her opinion. So this is the Ayurmedic Antibacterial Wash with exfoliating beads for blemished skin. And this does not have salicylic acid in it, which is really nice. And you can use it every single day, morning and night, and it's really nice for exfoliating. And I personally really like it. Um, I used it tonight, which is the first night, but the lady told me you can use it morning and night. Okay, then right here I have Witch Hazel, which is my toner. And it's just completely, like, all natural. It's just Witch Hazel. Um, and I use this as my toner because it's really, really gentle and it removes any dirt and excess makeup that your facial wash didn't get off. And it's super cheap. It's like $3 at Target. And it's way cheaper than all the other toners out there on the market. And personally, it's very gentle and it's just as effective. Okay, right here I have this Corrective Control Clear Med Acne... I guess spot treatment. I just use this whenever I have really, really, really bad breakouts. Um, normally I can just use my Kate Somerville one, which I'll get to in a second, but if I have a really bad breakout, I will use this one. And then right here I have my Clinique Moisture Surge, which is my all-time favorite moisturizer. It's honestly, to me, it's a really, really great hydrating moisturizer, but it's not thick and heavy, so I like it a lot. And then right here is my new favorite product. This is my Alouette right here. My Alouette Exfoliating or Restorative Enzyme Peel. And I think I want to do a video like all about this because this is literally like the coolest thing ever. Um, basically you put it on and then you start massaging it into your skin and then you can feel the dead skin coming off of your face. It's disgusting but it's super rewarding and it makes your skin feel really clean and soft. Okay, then right underneath I have my Peter Thomas Roth Gentle Complexion Correction Pads, which I use probably like every other week, and I love them. I just cut them in half, and they are amazing at exfoliating. Then I have another exfoliator. This is my Kate Somerville Exfoliate, which is a really intense exfoliator, but I absolutely love it. Um, the difference between these two I kind of talked about in my skincare routine, so if you would like to hear more about every single product, then you can check out my skincare routine, which I will link in the below bar. But as you can see, there are some new additions to my skincare routine. And then right here is my Kate Somerville Acne Treatment, basically just spot treatment. And it's a sulfur treatment, which is why I really like it. So I would definitely recommend checking that out if you are allergic to salicylic acid or something like that. I just don't use salicylic acid, so that's why I really like the Kate Somerville one. Plus, sulfur is not going to irritate your skin at all, um, unless you're allergic to sulfur. It just dries out the skin, so it'll dry out any blemishes that you have. Okay, then I have my Sun Lab Self Tanning Lotion, which I'm so excited to start using for summer, and it's just a great self tanner. Okay, then we are going to move up a level, so I'm going to sit on the counter now. Again, at the far left, I have my Tanda Zap, which is amazing. Literally, that is the coolest gadget, and it has helped my skin so much. Basically, it's just a blue light that you put on your skin, and it kills bacteria underneath the surface on your face. And I promise you when I say that it is amazing, and it was only $49 at Sephora. Then I have my PMD Neutralizing Toner, 
which I use after I use my PMD, uh, what is it? It's like an exfoliator. It is a microdermabrasion system, and I love that. And then I only use that after my PMD. And then I have my hair, skin, and nail vitamins, which is just basically biotin and some other things like zinc and other really great things for your skin. And then behind there, that little blue bottle is just an empty container that I like to take some witch hazel in when I travel. Then I have my pink aura brush and my toothbrush right there. I just keep them right there, so nothing super special. Then moving up, I have some Vaseline some manicure scissors, I have some random Q-tips, and then I have my Bobbi Brown, my Brown, Bobbi Brown Hydrating Eye Cream, which is amazing, I love that stuff. And then I have my Multiply Eye Serum from Tarte, which is supposed to make your lashes grow and be thicker and healthier, and I'm gonna do a review on that. I still haven't, I still haven't really fully decided if I like it yet, it works, but um, there's some pros and cons, so I probably will do a video if you want me to, just let me know. Okay, now we're at the very top, and this is my brush guard set. So, I have this right here, which I'm going to take out. I have all my little brush guards in there when I use to clean my brushes. This is the only way that I clean my brushes now. It is my favorite way. It is the best, most efficient, effective way. I love the brush guard, and I would 100% completely recommend using them and checking them out. I have the brush card squeaky clean brush shampoo and then this little towel. Every single thing in their kit that it comes with is amazing and I would 100% recommend it. Absolutely phenomenal. This even has jojoba oil in it which I mean that's insane to me. Okay then I have this little hair oil treatment which I've never used. I don't even know why it's up there. And then I have some Kleenexes. Yay! So that was the end of my random tour of my medicine slash skincare cabinet. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you would like to follow me on Twitter or Instagram, my username is Brie Loves Beauty. I love posting on Instagram, so if you are obsessed like I am, you should definitely follow me on that because I take pictures way too often and post them on there way too often. So let me know if you guys would like to see a nighttime slash bedtime routine video. I would also like to inform you that I'm going to be doing an updated getting ready video because my last one was like a year and a half or two years ago. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you all very soon. Bye everyone.